What's up, everybody? Welcome to this edition of Let's Play. Hearthstone. So here's the deal. Uh, I thought I'd do this first. Show me winning, hopefully. And then I'll talk my mess. And I have a theory regarding Hearthstone. Um, this was not my current ranking as of yesterday. As of yesterday, my current ranking was 17. I was ranked 17. And what's the difference between yesterday and and now which is 19 is that i lost a buttload of games back to back to back and i have a little theory regarding it so i will express that but i'm hoping i'm hoping to do good on this i'm hoping to win which would further my theory if i do win and then i feel more confident saying it <laughs> anyway welcome to ready for games first time blizzard players um a first time blizzard player myself Hasn't even been what? Four months? Five months? Much less than that. Um, so if you're new to the channel, welcome. If you're someone who's already subscribed to the channel, thanks for watching this video and welcome again. Um, you don't have to be a first time Blizzard player to, to like the channel. I mean, in fact, I ask that if you are not a first time Blizzard player to subscribe, please, so you can help us first time Blizzard players. <laughs> um, but this is Hearthstone, if you're not familiar, it is a trading card style type game. Um, they did have a World of Warcraft trading card game that, I, that I've really been wanting to get, but I, I can't find it anywhere. Which makes sense, because they just they discontinued it, but, you know, I figured somebody would have it. But my local kind of comic book shop, the only thing they got is like open cards, and they're like 20 cents each. And I'm like, well, I don't even know what kind of cards I need. I'd kind of prefer to get, if possible, a... Like starter kind of card deck and I looked online they have some on eBay but again I'm confused I don't know if it comes everything because like from what I've seen online the game had like dice and stuff and I don't know I don't know I thought well because I was trying to get my son into playing and I thought well let's try this Pokemon uh, card game since he likes Pokemon and nah, I just got him into Hearthstone. I opened up an account. He's playing Hearthstone now because <laughs> it's just I don't I don't really know how to do the other stuff. And I'm like, mm -mm. I'm too old to try to, to get into new things. Nah, I'm just stick with this. So he's doing pretty good actually though. I mean he, he ain't on my level, you know. But you know who is on my level? <laughs> pretty much everybody like playing right now was past me. I bet you this person probably already passed me. He's probably in the same position, or he, I don't know who it is. Same position that I'm in. Um, when I'm referring to my little theory. But hopefully I'll win this game. And uh, my theory will come to fruition. Uh, let's do that. I like playing this card because, you know, I've only actually played it you know, as far as to hit the enemy one time. But I like playing it because... It's three health, and they they panic. They see that wind fury, and I notice they will use a monster kind of card to silence or to to get rid of this minion more than even the taunt minion. Um, mm -hmm. When in reality, the damage is only four. That's the most I'm gonna get you in the beginning. I'm not saying not to get rid of the card. But I mean, I think it's just the wind that scares them. Let's see what they're gonna do here. What is this? Ah. You gonna deal with some of my taunt, or what are you doing? See that? Well, that move I wouldn't I don't understand. Well, hold on. there you go. Never mind. Maybe that's what it is. He probably did something. I hate that secret where it's like deal two damage to all enemies. So I'm gonna take that risk. Play this one. Do this. Do this. Do this. And there it is. When a character attacks you here and says, Aww. Oh, that's okay. I can live with that. I can live with two. I've never seen that secret, actually. So I'm okay with that. I still did damage to him. And he didn't actually, you know, get rid of my card there. So I'm okay. I'm okay with that. I can live with that hunter person. But I don't know. I don't know. I, my, like I said, I've been actually playing for quite, quite a while, and I'm confident in the deck that I have now, especially because I was just wiping out. But I noticed that I kept going down, going up, going down. 
And so that's when my little theory came into play. And I've been kind of testing my theory out for the past four or five days. And it's pretty much been happening. So I guess I'll go ahead and tell you my theory now. Hopefully it doesn't distract. Yeah, that's, that's what it is. Distraction. Um, what do I do here? What do I do here? If I play the taunt, it'll make this to three. But he has four, so he'll hurt me anyway. It'll make this to five. And he has four anyway. You know what? We're gonna do this. Um. What to do? What to do? My shield do for Argus. Um. No, 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 no. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Uh, you hear that? Oh, stupid. <laughs> that was my mistake. That's okay. I mean, cleaned out his board. Dang it, that was dumb. Anyway, don't let that affect my little theory I'm about to say. So here's my theory. Um, I usually play in the morning and in the evening. Uh, during the day, I'm obviously, I'm, I'm working or something, so I don't really have a lot of time to play. And what was happening is I noticed that in the morning, I would do okay. I'd probably win like two and then lose three or, you know, kind of. If I played five games, let's say, I'd lose two, win three or vice versa. But pretty pretty much always kind of even. And if I played at night as far as, let's say, or evening, I should say, like five o'clock, six o'clock, like I lost every game. So what I started to do actually was I tried my little theory out. Wait, hmm, should I use this now? No, I'm not gonna uh, get behind you instead. And let's do that for fun. Into the and, and um, my theory was well when I started playing, uh, I basically started getting free time during the day. So what I started doing is I was playing during the day, because at evening I would pretty much lose, like I said. So I was bored, so I played during the day. <laughs> And during the day, around central time, 9 in the morning, 10 in the morning, I mean, I just got killing. I would go to levels, I'd go to rank 16, 15, and it was just like back to back. Of course, because you get bonus stars if you win in a row. Um, if you win three in a row, you get bonus stars. So that's what was happening. I was just like, boom, crazy stuff. So I'm all excited, thinking like, oh, yeah, I'm the best. And then I'd play, you know, around 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock, and I would just lose over and over and over again and i'm like what is going on because okay, so. i i did so well like how all of a sudden am i just gonna lose it doesn't make any sense and then i played in the evening i mean nighttime like around nine o'clock ten o'clock p.m and again just back to back to back to back to back i just non-stop like if i was down if i would get down to rank 20 at five or six i hate that <laughs> This isn't going good for me. It looks like I'm going to lose. I don't really care because I'm kind of talking about my theory more, but I kind of knew this was going to happen considering the fact of my theory, which is right now it's not 9 in the morning. It's later. Um, yeah, so I, I'd play, and then... Uh, oh, crap. I lost my train of thought. <laughs> I would basically... I would, I, would, I would do a killing at 10 o'clock. So, and then in the morning I'd wake up, and I'd play and like, oh, I'm on fire, and I'd just lose constantly. Uh, well. So it was frustrating, because I'm like, oh, what is going on here? And what, what, what pissed me off more is, it's not like I'm playing... Well, the players that I'd be playing are on the same rank level, pretty much, obviously. They're not going to put me against a rank 1 if I'm rank 15. But, the cards that I would get out, and the cards that they would get out were insane. They would have, like... Four, uh, there's one instance where I played someone and they literally had four legendary cards. I was just shocked because I'm like, what am I supposed to do? I, how am I supposed to compete with four <laughs> legendary cards? I'm screwed. You know what I mean? I'm like, what am I going to do? And yeah, I'm like, just, I don't, I didn't know what to do. So I just pretty much played him thinking like, you know, I'm going to give it my best. I'm going to do the best that I can. And I, I got killed pretty fast. I, I was done. And so... I'm like freaking out, and so for the past couple of days, like I said, what I've been doing is, I'd be playing, I've been playing around nine in the morning, ten o'clock in the morning, and boom, like I'll get five wins in a row. I'll play in the evening, 
around 10 o'clock, 9 o'clock, and again, I'll get real maybe four or five wins. And then I'll play during the afternoon to see and I'll just get killed. So here's my theory. Here's what I'm wondering. And, and if any of y'all have faced the same thing, let me know. Um, as far as if y'all face, face the same thing in the the fact that you well, this should hopefully put some pressure on them. You win a couple you win a lot and lose some. Try doing what I'm talking about. Try the timing. Because my theory is this. This is all randomized, and I know I'm going to sound like a real conspiracist if I say this, but I know it's all randomized, it's all computer. It's not like Blizzard's there like, ooh, ooh, ooh. but I'm like, there has to be, is there a formula or something maybe that they're not, that they have or something wrong where you play, depending how you play, you basically, like, in other words, I have all the cards that I have, right? And when I'm playing... My, around those times, my cards are, are just ridiculously terrible. Like, really bad. I mean, I'm just like, man, why did I even pick these kind of cards? They're really bad cards. And so I'm thinking, like, is is there maybe a computer, like a mathematical number or something? Maybe it's a, a mess up on their part. Because I'll get just literally junk cards, and they'll be getting just boom, boom, back to back cards, depending on the time, like I said. And like I said, it just confuses me because in my mind, I'm like, yeah, it's the belt. It's not about the card. It's, I mean, it's more about how you play the cards, shouldn't it be? More than than that. But no, it just it seems like if I play at these times, like I said, I'm good. I shouldn't have done that. that was oh, actually, I'm okay. We, we got this. Well, no, we don't got this necessarily. Um, I'm going to do this. Do this. Do this. Hopefully, we'll put on them. But, yeah, I even had, oh my gosh, I even had another game where I'm playing, and it's the same situation. When he, they weren't at one. They were, like, at health eight or nine, and I was at 30, and just boom. Every single card he pulled out was, like, 10, 10 damage, and I'm just like, come on. But we, we should beat this one. So, I don't know. I'm just, this, I guess, was more of a vent video. <laughs> I thought it was going to be kind of me, like, talking. I, I'm going to show you my card deck here, too. Um, but, yeah, I don't know. I guess if, if you're... If you want to try my little theory, or if you have the same problem, try my theory, I guess, I should say, and see if it works for you. Um, because, yeah, what I've kind of done is I stopped playing early in the morning and and, er, and late at, or early evening, I should say, as well, and played just more in the midday and late at night. Now, this is the deck that I use for the mage now. This is different from the last video I showed you, where I was, it was terrible. And I've had a lot of good, 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 good wins with this deck, so... Let me break it down for you. Um, and that way you can get it if you want. I got one Dire Wolf Alpha. Uh, two of the Frost Wolf Grunt. Two of the Earthen Ring Farseer. One of the Flesh Eating Ghoul. Three, I mean, three. Two of the Infer Grizzly. One of the Mind Control Tech, which is not a card you might have. You might have to buy that, which I could show you what I did to buy it. Um, two of the Raid Leader, one of the Wind Fury, one of the Charge Wolf Rider, one of the Polymorph, two of the Defender of Argus, two of the Senjin Shield Master, two of the Booty Bay Bodyguard, <laughs> one of the Fan, Fan Creeper, two of the Frost Wolf Warlord, one of the Lord of the Arena, one of the Priestess of Eluna, or Lune, whatever, <laughs> one of the Sunwalker, one of the Wind Fury Harpy, two of the flame strike and one of the stormwind champion so here's what i did as far as to get kind of these cards like this one uh and actually this one and this one i didn't have these cards all i did was basically play a buttload of games in gold get into the arena because arena gives you uh sometimes it'll give you a lot of the arcane dust as well as cards um and all i did was basically decide what deck i'm gonna use i'm like okay a mage for life so I did mage deck and then all the other cards I pretty much just disenchanted them. So then I was able to get enough arcane dust to get the next to get you know the card that I wanted. Now of course that takes a long time. So you know that I'm just telling you this, especially if you're new to, to Blizzard games, if you're new to Hearthstone, I definitely would suggest you play in the free play mode. Um because with free play mode your your likelihood is much better of getting uh wins and stuff like that you play rank i mean it's i'm not saying you're not gonna win 
But with rank, it's just like it sounds. You're really competing. Casual is just fun. You're playing against my son. You're playing against my wife. You're playing against people like you as well, where it's kind of like, you know what? Let's just play. I just want to play, play, play. So find a deck, and this is a perfect opportunity in casual mode to find a deck that you want to play, whether it's Hunter, Priest. I mean, mess, this is your time to play with all of those decks. Figure out which one you want. Once you figure out what you want, I suggest then all of the gold and everything that has been adding up in casual play, as well as all the extra cards, use it. And the gold, use it for the arena, because that'll get you the arcane dust and more cards that you can burn for more arcane dust, so you can really maximize your deck. Like, what's funny is on my mage deck here, I actually got a legendary. I bought, I bought, I bought, a, uh, what is it? Legendary? Rare? What, what is this? This one is what I bought, a legendary, and I don't use it anymore. Um, I don't use it anymore because of the fact that the way I set my deck up now, it's much more, it's better. What I was finding is with this legendary card, I was like, oh, I gotta use a lot of spells because I want to get fireballs, and I was just getting eliminated so quickly. But I bought this with the arcane dust by doing what I just said. So, you know, instead of buying tons of cards, you know, because I can add up ten bucks for seven. I think it's ten bucks for seven cards, or seven backs. Um, it's much better to play the pre the pre play. So I highly suggest, yeah, 10 bucks for seven packs. Um, I highly suggest you just replay and then pay attention to this. When you open up, it'll give you a quest log. So here it says Druid or, or Rogue Victory 40 if you win two games. If you win two games, 40. If you win two games, 40. So you'll see stuff like that come up. I highly suggest you really hit those hard because that's what I would do. And I would win. It's just two games. So I'd get Rogue and I'd win four, two, so that's 40. Then I'd switch to a Paladin and a Priest, 40, so that's 80. And then this, 120. So I was able to make one, sometimes even more than 120 every day in gold, where then I'm able to purchase uh, card packs if I had to, because the card packs are 100 uh, for gold. So anyway, but that's my video for today. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great night, day, week, whenever you're watching this. Follow me on Twitter, uh, like me on Facebook. I have one like on Facebook, and I think it's just me. <laughs> Add me on Google+. Plus. Have a great night, day, week, and whenever you're watching this, don't forget to subscribe button, share button. I'll see you on the next Let's Play Heartstone.